Jo, I'm, I'm so thrilled that you've joined us for this Silver Tent Launch Summit interview. And, you know, I've known of you for at least 10 years. I remember being at an event and somebody standing up on stage sharing your story. And, and I remember how touched I was by your extraordinary emotional courage. And, and you have so much wisdom and, and actually grace to share with everybody, but particularly with our viewers at the moment. And, and as you know, the Silver Tent is all about women over 50 to really recognize and embrace their wild, wonderful and wise elder selves. Mm -hmm. And your beautiful work with the gift of conflict is of so much value to every single one of us. So, so it's a, an incredible privilege to speak with you and to share this interview with our, with our viewers. And I wonder if you could just take a moment to give us just a brief overview of what you'd most like our viewers to receive from, from this interview. Well, thank you. That's the most beautiful introduction and really appreciate. It's a privilege to be part of the Silver Tent. So I've called my talk The Gift to Conflict, and I truly believe that there is a gift, a precious gift, with every challenge we have and with every conflict. And it's a journey that I've been on now since 84. It's a long journey, but I'm actually grateful for what I've been learning what I've learned about myself, what I'm still learning. And the one thing that I wish I'd known back then, well, there's probably lots of things, the one really big thing is that whatever I'm feeling is always understandable. And it's so easy to think that we should be feeling something else, but it all starts with exactly what we're feeling. And the way that I've been on this journey is to give up blame. And that's sometimes blaming an enemy, the other, or even blaming myself. And I believe we all have that capacity to transform our pain by giving up blame. And when we transform our pain and our challenges, we're given gifts, we're given increased compassion, empathy, love, can connect with each other. And I really believe that we are one human family and through seeing the humanity of every single person we can change the world, we are changing the world.